Welcome to Academy of Civil Service. Government of India has launched Hargar Tiranga campaign as part of Azadi Ka Amrud Mahal Sav. On this occasion, every one of us are busy with buying national flag and hoisting it over our houses, shops and companies everywhere. But do you know the story of India's national flag? Who has designed it? When it was designed? There was a young man from Madras Presidency. He went to Cambridge University for doing his higher studies. Later he joined the British Indian Army as a soldier. He was sent to South Africa for fighting the Second Boer War. That time, as a soldier of British Indian Army, he used to salute Union Jack, the national flag of the British government. That time he thought about the national flag of his country. There is no national flag for my country. I am coming from India. That time he struck with the idea of designing a national flag for his own country. That man is Pinkhali Vengaya from the present day state of Andhra Pradesh. He has tried multiple times around 30 designs and he has even published a book containing all the designs that he had tried for the national flag of India. In 1921, he met Mahatma Gandhi and presented his design of the national flag. It contained two color, one color red representing the Hindu community, other color green representing the Muslim community. And Charka was there representing the welfare of the masses. On the suggestion of Mahatma Gandhi, white color was added on the top of the flag. Now, you can tell me what is represented by this white color? Moving on, from 1921 to 1931, even though this design was not officially accepted by the Congress, Congress was using the same design for all the sessions of the Congress. And this design, originally presented by Pinkali Vengaya, was called as the Swaraj flag. But in 1931, there was concern regarding the colors representing the communities. So the Congress decided to appoint a national flag committee and on the suggestion of that national flag committee, the order of the color was changed with the saffron at the top. Red color was replaced by the saffron color and in the middle white color, then the green color. Charka went inside of the green band of the national flag. From 1931, this national flag was used by the Congress. But still, this is not the design of the present day national flag. On 1947, the Constituent Assembly appointed a flag committee for making modification in the design of the national flag. On the basis of the recommendation of the national flag committee, the design was again changed. The Charka was replaced by the Ashoka Chakra in the middle of the national flag because many of the representatives from other political parties, they were not happy with the charka in the middle of the national flag. That is how the charka was replaced with the Ashoka Chakra. And the Ashoka Chakra, that represent the motion, the progress of the country. That is how the design which was presented by Pinkali Vengaya transformed into present day tricolor design. On this occasion of Azadika Amrit Mahal Sav, we have to remember many unsung hero of the freedom struggle. And we can say Pinkali Vengaya was one among them. Now tell me whether this unsung hero of the freedom struggle, was he confirmed Bharat Ritna by government of India? Yes or no? You can comment your answer below in the comment section. And if you have enjoyed the video, and if you are having any more doubts regarding preparation of history, you can ask in the comment below and we will be coming up with more videos. Thank you.